Number three, teach your children to avoid immorality completely. You know why this is important? First Corinthians chapter three, verse sixteen to seventeen. First Corinthians chapter three, verse sixteen to seventeen. So know you not that you are the temple of God, that the Spirit of God dwells in you. If any man defy the temple of God, him shall go and destroy. For the temple of God is holy, which you are. Do you know what God is saying? Anybody that engages in immorality, God himself will destroy the person. God will not send an angel. God will personally supervise the destruction of the person. I'm praying for you. Any trace of immorality in your life, from today, abandon it completely. From today, abandon it completely. It's possible that even the parents are living a wrong example. You are telling your children, be ready. But you are still carrying girlfriends all over the place. You are telling your, your children, be ready. You are still doing a wedding manual. You are great man in love. I pray for you. You will not leave your children as free. And for every child that is listening to me, anything that is immoral, run away from it. Don't let God destroy you. God has a great plan for you. God has a great future for you. You will not destroy it with immorality in the mighty name of Jesus. You know, I've talked to some children. You'll be amazed what they know. You'll be amazed what they're already doing. Oh, you'll be shocked. But I pray for you. Your children will not be among them. If your children are gone astray, God will bring them back to his purpose in the mighty name of Jesus.